Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I'm barefaced because I'm going to do my boxy charm unboxing and I'm gonna do it I'm gonna do it try on style this month. Um so I'm gonna dig into the box. That's why I have a bare face, see what's in there. I kinda know what's in there because I've been watching the spoilers and stuff. But um yeah, so if you don't know what boxy charm is, it is a monthly uh, beauty subscription service it's $21 a month and every three months they have the boxy lux which you're able to upgrade and it's 28 28 dollars um, on top of the $21 uh, every three months so yeah there's always every month there's always over a hundred and over a hundred dollars I believe I always get I always get roughly $120 or more worth of things in my boxes and the boxy lux is usually 250 and up um, so I really think that it's worth it. I am a makeup addict, so I always, you know, I was always buying stuff, and I really haven't been shopping for makeup because of the subscription service, which is BoxyCharm. I'm obsessed with it. It keeps me, you know, getting new makeup, new skincare, and I'm saving a lot of money doing it that way. Um, so yeah, uh, I have my little helper right here. And um, so yeah, if you want to see what I got in this month's box and watch me try it on, then just keep watching. Put your makeup. Okay, so here's the box. So first off, I want to start by saying the boxes. I don't know if they've gotten cheaper, like they're being cheaply made, but every month now that I receive my box, it is damaged, it is destroyed, it looks like shit. But we're gonna go past that because the products are not messed up. Only one. One month I had a problem with one of my products messed up. And they actually replaced it within two weeks, I think it was. They sent me a new um, product, which was really nice. But yeah, so this is the box, all torn up. And this is the inside. So it always comes with the pamphlet. And this month's theme is all, all natural. All natural. And this is just tells you everything you got in the box. So I'm going to tell you what I got in the box and also insert some information or okay the baby's playing with the drawer where my camera is so if I'm shaking sorry stop so Mama. I'm gonna insert the prices and some info for each of the products as I'm showing them um so the first thing here that I want to take out is the Luxie Gaia three-piece brush brush set this retails for $30 and sorry and this retails for $30. And it says here, create the perfect look with your new eco-friendly eco Luxie brush set. Apply foundation with the Luxie 510 foundation brush. Blend your eyeshadow with the Luxie 250 large eye blending brush. And precisely apply color to your crease with the Luxie 246 precision crease brush. And it comes in this little packaging. And it says, unleash your true, your true beauty by being kind to the earth. Please help keep our planet beautiful by recycling this package. So I like that it comes in this. I actually like it. And I've been getting a lot of Luxie brushes through BoxyCharm. And I love their brushes. They're super, like, nice quality. And the packaging, like, the these this part, what is this called? The handles are so pretty. Um, I didn't understand what one of the girls was talking about. The packaging, like, the... Thing, but it's like a pink wood. I don't know if you can see it. It's so pretty. I love it. Can you see? It's like a pink wood. I love it. And then they always are like with the white head. So this is the foundation brush. This is the large blending brush. And this is the precise brush. What happened? Which one you want? You want the little one? Here. Put it on your eyes. <coughs> Put it on your eye. I need this one. Go. Okay, and then the next thing I have here is the Elemis Superfood Vital Veggie Mask, Nourishing Prebiotic Green Mask, Advanced Skin Care, and, okay, my light is insane right now. So this is what it looks like. And this is $35. And I'm actually going to try this on now. My face is bare. I have nothing on my face um so i'm gonna use the foundation brush to put the mask on because i don't really use brushes uh for my foundation so no it smells good hmm. but, okay so i'm just gonna put this and my face is clean i don't have anything on my face so we're gonna put that on no no 
The baby wants um, my mask, but she can't have it. She's like, Mom, what are you doing? I want to do it. So my daughter, she's only, well, she'll be two in September. So she's like one and a half. And she, if she sees uh, makeup, like, she knows what it is. Like, if she sees, like, an a eyeshadow palette, she'll point at her, she'll go and point at her eyes. Like, you know, like, she knows that it's for her eyes. When she sees lipstick, she goes to her lips. She knows that it's lipstick. And I'm just like, yeah, this is my child. <laughs> she knows. Okay. So, hold on, Nana. Yes. You can't put this on. Okay, so this smells really nice. It says here, apply mask twice weekly on cleansed skin. A slight tingling may occur. That's with every mask. And it says, remove after 10 minutes with a damp, dark cloth. I have been seeing reviews and um, the damp, dark, they say damp, dark cloth because this may stain. So I'll come back in 10 minutes and wipe this off. So I'm back. It's been 10 minutes. I'm going to wipe it off. I got my damp, dark cloth here. Okay, so it smells really really nice i like the way it smells um it didn't feel like it was burning my skin or anything like that like i didn't it was like barely a tingle like i've tried some masks that are like really intense so that one i like i like it so far all right so the next thing i have in the box is this butter london eyeshadow palette and i've been watching reviews on it and it is absolutely gorgeous I am actually going to try to recreate a look that OMG Lashes um, did. I fell in love with the look. So I'm going to try to recreate it with this palette. Hold on, mama. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold on. And that palette, what is it called? Just says Butter London. Let me see. Butter London Natural Goddess Eyeshadow Palette. And that retails for $32. Now, the next thing in my box, the baby has in her hand. Let me show, okay? is the Ofra Liquid Lipstick in Santorini. This is really, really bright. I don't know if I'm gonna use it. I might just try it on, but it's really bright, really intense, so I don't know if I'm gonna use that. And that retails for $20. And the last thing in the box is the Appeal Gel Liner, and this one is in the color Deep Taupe. So it's like a, a deep brown color. I'm excited to try it because like everybody has been saying, usually when we get um, usually when we get uh, uh, eyeliners in these boxes, they're usually like really bad and like dry and horrible. But this is a gel liner and I've been seeing a lot of people, what happened? Okay, let me open it. I've been seeing a lot of people enjoying it and saying it's really good, so I can't wait to try. If I can open it. Oh, like this. And it looks promising. Hold on, hold on, hold on, okay? So, I don't know if I said, but that's $21. And it says, line and define your eyes or lips with your new Appeal Gel Liner. So, it's just a gel liner. You can use it for... You can use it for your lips or for your eyes. I'm going to use it um, for my eyes. Um, so, yeah, that is all I got in my box. I will enter the complete uh, value of the box on the screen somewhere and yeah i'm gonna do my foundation and all that stuff off camera and i'm gonna come back and try on the eyeshadows i'll be right back all right so i'm back i got my full face on popping um i just filled in my eyebrows like really quick i just kind of like you know messily whatever so yeah so now it's time to dive in to this bad boy right here I'm going to start off with this deep brown shade called Temptress. And I'm going to take the big, the large, Luxie, large, what? Luxie, large eye blending brush that came in the box as well. And holy pigment, that's insane. It has a little bit of kickback, but that's okay. And I'm just going to tap it and then blend it.
now I'm going to go in with the color Queen, which is this shade right here. I'm gonna have swatches of all the shades somewhere on the screen, but this color is the one I'm gonna take. I'm gonna take it with my finger and just pack it onto my eyelid. That is beautiful. So pigmented, so intense, I love it. So now I'm gonna go in, I have another Luxie brush that I got in my Boxy Lux December box, I believe. And this is the tapered blending brush, and it looks like this. And I'm just gonna like lightly tap it and just blend out this outer corner, this brown part right here real quick. And I'm bringing it into the crease and I just wanna blend it. I don't want the colors to have any harsh lines. Same as for the other side. Leilani, what are you doing? Okay, so um, I don't want to do eyeliner. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to take a... Do I have one here? I'm going to take a definer brush and I'm going to put the... Black, uh, not the black. I'm going to put the brown on the... Like, you know, where I would put my eyeliner. So I'm going to take that same brown color... And I'm gonna put it with this e.l.f. definer brush, and I'm gonna put it on, and I'm gonna put it on as an eyeliner. Okay, so now I'm gonna do the lower lash line. And I'm going to turk. I'm going to take the other Luxie brush that I got, the 246 Precision Crease Brush, and I'm going to use that to do the bottom part. So I'm going to use this very pretty turquoise blue color called Femme Fatale. And I'm going to put that down there. So now, I'm done with this. Well, I'm not done, but almost done with this palette. Um, actually, I'll do it now. I'm going to take this MAC. This is a MAC brush. It's an angled brush. I don't know what kind of brush it is because it has no writing on it, but it's a MAC angled brush. And I'm going to take the color Enchant Enchantress. That's like a tongue twister. And I'm going to put that in the inner corners of my eyes. Intense. The pigment on these shadows are amazing. Oh my gosh, I am absolutely in love. Like, look at that, it's so pretty. I'm just gonna take this and try to blend it a little bit. Wow, do you see that? Like the pigment, I gotta blend that up there a little bit. Okay, so I'm done with this palette. And this palette is absolutely gorgeous. I can see myself reaching for this palette actually a lot. So now the next thing I'm gonna put the Appeal Gel Liner. I'm gonna put it in my waterline. Now I'm gonna put on my mascara. I've been using the It, Cosme it Cosmetics Superhero Mascara and I believe I got this also in a BoxyCharm. If not BoxyCharm, in a Fat Fit Fun box. I think I got this in the boxy chart. This mascara makes me look like I have falsies on. It's insane. It's super black and lengthening, and I love it so much. Do you see that? Jeez. Okay, now for the finishing, I decided I am going to use this as a lip liner because I can't find any of my brown ones. I know I have a few ones, but 
can't find it. So I'm gonna just use the appeal one. And I'm gonna fill in my lips with the, oh my gosh, my hands are so dirty. I'm gonna fill in my lips with this Becca Cosmetics lipstick in Bare. This is the ultimate lipstick love, and I did get this in a boxy charm, I think in March. This lipstick is amazing, but we're not talking about the lipstick, we're talking about boxy charm. All right, so. Hey. This is the completed look. Overall, I really like all the products that I got this month. Um, it's it wasn't like an how do I explain? It wasn't like oh my god, I can't wait get wait to get the box because everything seemed kind of like you know okay, well we've gotten skin products, um, skincare products. We've been getting a lot of that, and you know we've gotten palettes like with more colors. We've gotten bigger palettes from companies that we are more familiar with. Um, we've gotten brushes, uh, like big brush sets and stuff, but once you actually receive the products and use them, that changes. I absolutely am in love with my box this month. Um, the skincare product that came in, the uh, uh, LMS Superfood Vital Veggie Mask, I'm reading from the card, it's it's like perfect it's not too overpowering the scent it smells really nice it doesn't burn your face it's not too intense um i'm gonna keep on using it to see you know if i see any differences um we did receive uh elemis uh skincare product i think it was like a moisturizer in december boxy Lux, and i really liked it i went through the whole thing so i don't even have the bottle to show you like the jar um it was amazing and i think that was like 80 something dollars and we got in the boxy Lux um last year in december um the liner the gel liner is amazing i will so use it i think i will mostly use it as a lip liner because i do have a liner that i prefer which is the la girl brown liner and also the mac liner costa riche for my waterline the brown those are my brown liners that i use um but i do really like it. it's really creamy it's really soft and i like the way it looks on my lips i like that lip combo and the eyeshadow palette is bomb like the pigment is insane it's so pretty it's so natural like i can do this i can make do this look like to go anywhere i you know it's it's perfect i love it um and the brushes are nice the brushes i love luxie brushes are super soft um and yeah i i really really enjoyed this month's box um a new video will be going up most likely tomorrow i'm gonna have my amazon favorites um, so yeah, as always, thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to like this video, comment, subscribe, hit the notification bell so you can be notified every time I upload a new video. And yeah, thanks so much guys. See you in the next one. Bye.